Well, what can I say? Paris for lunch. What a move. There was a blinder from start to finish. Uh, well, we did have a little bit of a scare. A couple of scares, really. Went through border control. Went through ticket control. Just as we were stepping onto the train. The, the woman checking the tickets went, whoa, 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 hold it, hold it. Then no, this is the train for Brussels. Good job she was on the ball. We would have ended up in fucking Belgium. So that was all good. Um, cut the gin and tonics on the on the train. When we come out of here, I've got some instructions. I've got a little map, but you know we don't know Paris that well. So. The tube station, the metro, is right bang next door to where we get off the Euro Star train. 100 yards away, sweet. We know what way to go. As of, as there's one like just pulling out, doors are shutting, I've made a run for it. Left nearly behind. So anyway, I stayed on, went all the way to Montparnasse, waited there, and she turned up a couple minutes later on the on the following train. Come out of there. We were like 150 yards from the from the restaurant we bought. Oh, it's a beautiful place, beautiful. And the food was exceptionally good. All, all seafood. Prawns, winkles, lobster, crab, oysters, clams. Oh, fucking hell. Shrimps. Um, lovely bottle of wine, a couple of glasses of champagne. And then... Pretty much I should let the rush back and get on the train for uh, come on. Got home about half past twelve last night. Left at half past ten. So yeah, lunch in Paris. Well worth it for a, a treat. Can't do it every week. If she was like cakes right up. But, um, yeah, Nina's birthday. She loved it and that's what counts. She loved it. That's what counts, it's her birthday. She'll probably get me a pair of socks for mine. <laughs> Rain always brings them out. I wish I knew what it was that all makes them cross the path when there's been rain. I can only really assume that wherever they live, it's been flooded and they're looking to kind of get up to get to higher ground or something, or drier ground. But you never see them when there's when there ain't been no rain. Don't even know where they go. But I'll tell you what. It's very busy over here for the time of morning. Nice to see a few puddles back again. I think they might have been fast snaps, I'll have to check. 